name is Gracie and I teach Gracie Jiu Jitsu. I don't think about it because if I think about it, I wouldn't end up, I wouldn't be in the ring fighting because there's a lot of pressure. Well, everything I learned was from my father, my brothers, so it's just not making my own style. I just follow the directions, what they give it to me, and uh, trusted, trained very hard, a lot of dedication, and here I am today. I would say what separates me from the other fighters, it's dedication, knowing how to study the fight, knowing how to, how to train for it, there's no, I'll do it tomorrow. No, I'm going to do it today. Tell me what's impossible and I'll prove you wrong. Well, you win the fight on the training camp. So you got to train for that day, to be able to peak in one day. And when you get in the ring, it's all just automatic pilot clicks on. There's no time to think about it. I just listen to my coaches. Whatever they say, I'll go ahead and do it. They ask me and I'll deliver. My mother always said that I had selective hearing. So yes, I do hear only who I want to hear. <laughs> Everybody else is blank out. <laughs> toughest fight for me is inside of my head, my imagination. Who's your toughest fight? Your imagination. What you think I'm going to do to you. I might not do anything to you. I might be nice to you. I might just choke you out, put you to sleep. But your imagination would think that I'm going to break your neck and break your arms and then wake you up and break again. And it's your imagination. That's the toughest opponent you got.